what do you think? Would you be willing to be our surrogate? Yeah. They found a perfect surrogate to give them a child. To be told that she can't have her own biological children. I don't think she's ever given up hope on having her own family. But a dark secret from the past. You had the dream again, huh? Yeah. Has resurfaced with a vengeance. George loves me very much. He's not leaving me. If he knew your secret, he would. I hate you! She judges you. But you want to love her because... She raised you. Now, the memories that haunt her. Your father didn't fall asleep with a lit cigarette? No! No! Will feed the jealousy that drives her. You're not going jogging too, are you? The doctor said a little light jogging's no problem. Yeah, see a little bit. You don't always have to take her side. There are no sides here, Alice. Hey, Sarge, you got the rest of those patient files on the Zeller case? I don't want them here when the baby is born. Come on, Alice. You are getting too close. A desperate woman pulled toward the edge of sanity. I don't want to talk about my aunt, so don't bring her up again, now or ever. We have to. No, we don't! Are you going to divorce me and marry her? Is that your plan? I think we need to rethink this living arrangement. Why did you tell me you weren't there when she died? She doesn't know. Ah! You have to convince her not to go, please. I never thought it would get this bad. You need to get her some help. You have wanted her to be with George since we started. But that's not true. Nobody takes my baby away, you bitch. Tracy Nelson. If she leaves this house, George, I'm gonna do it. Heather Tom. She's got a knife and she's threatening to kill herself. Linda Ashby and Barbara Niven. Detective Martin responds to that 901A. You betrayed me. <laughs> <laughs> I came for my baby. The rival. What are you doing? <sighs> Stop acting crazy. <laughs>